Footballers have always accessorised their kit in strange ways, and different trends have always come and gone. Robbie Fowler and his nose plasters in the 1990s, the Alice Band craze of the following decade, which was popularised by David Beckham, ankle tape, spool shin pads, the list continues. But one of the stranger trends has stuck around and shows no sign of going anywhere. So, why are footballers cutting holes in their socks? Everyone has seen this, although it doesn't always appear in the same way. Some players cut a single hole in the back of their socks, others cut several. In a few cases, players have been seen sporting strange patterns and wearing socks which at the back have been modified with all sorts of squares, circles, slips and cut. Some players also try to disguise their handiwork, wearing a same coloured stocking underneath their sock to hide the holes. Others don't bother, and cheerfully wear raggedy match kit which causes older, traditional fans to roll their eyes. But for what reason? Well, it's about calf muscles and polyester. It's common for players to wear new, out-of-the-packet socks several times within the same season. Football socks are also very tight-fitting. For instance, during the 2022 World Cup, England's Jude Bellingham was pictured with holes in the back of his socks, socks which were made from roughly 88% polyester. Some of the advantages of polyester, in this context at least, are that it doesn't retain water and that it is relatively good at keeping its shape. Given the various conditions in which football is played, those are both strengths. Nobody wants to play in sodden socks, and those socks also have to hold a shin pan in place. If a sock keeps its shape well, it also won't droop around the ankles. But in spite of those virtues, players can also find them restrictive, particularly those with larger calf muscles. Some players also believe that reducing the pressure on the muscle also helps performance, increasing blood flow to the area, and reducing the risk of cramp and injury. Although, that's more perception than reality. We asked three CB performances, Dr. Raj Bra, a doctor of physical therapy, and he told us that there's no real medical basis to support that. In fact, he told us, one way of medically reducing pressure on the calves is through using higher pressure compression socks in between games as a recovery measure. That will increase circulation and reduce swelling to varying degrees based on the level of pressure of the sock itself. Besides, footballers get more than enough activity through their calves to not worry about circulation and swelling pooling up. So, there's no need for any Sunday league footballers to play in compression socks, nor will cutting holes in the socks achieve anything more than added comfort and, arguably, a unique sense of style. If you like this video, please consider subscribing to the channel. The Athletic is home to some of the world's best sports journalists, including David Ornstein, Daniel Taylor, Ollie Kay, Amy Lawrence and Rafa Honigstein. There are journalists dedicated to each Premier League team, and you can try it for free now for 30 days. See the link in the description.